I moved to America because I had no choice. My mom sent for me, and that was back in 19, like probably 95 or so. And I was in school, I had no choice. So I'm living here, I'm here, trying to make the best life. Now, I'm a happy UPS sir, UPS driver, um, and do a hobby of photography and video. My passion, I honestly have to say, is creativity between photography and video. I just enjoy that world of, you know, capturing moments, seizing that moment, creating it, you know, seeing it from your perspective. Honestly, I got started up because I think my auntie, I, she used to travel a lot, Auntie Dolores. She traveled a lot, like Spain, Italy, and she always had these huge albums with pictures. So as a kid growing up, I was always going in her stuff. So I was able to see, you know, just her pictures. And that's how I really got inspired. And I just was, I like capturing moments. I think um, seeing the joy in others and knowing, like sometimes you do something for somebody, like in photography, for example, and five years pass and somebody was to say to you like, yo, you know that picture that you took with my grandmother or my auntie, that's the only one I have with them, or, and this is my real stories, you know? So just to be a part of people's family, you know, it, it becomes more personal, you know? And to know that they accept you or what, for what you do and who you are. The hardest part of doing photography is getting started. Getting started and not knowing how to sell yourself or to sell your work because a lot of people will try to take advantage of you seeing your potential and seeing your talent. The best advice I could give anybody is utilize all your resources that you have. Um, be YouTube friendly. Don't be afraid to ask your friends for pictures. Don't be afraid to fall asleep with your camera. But um, be bold, just be bold and seize every moment and know that it doesn't matter how much photographers are wrong, but you are the one capturing this, you know? And do your best, have fun, yeah.